Peace, peace, y'all. What it do to y'all in the chat again? <clears throat> hey, Lady Juice. Damn. I love you too, boo. So, y'all, we need, we need to talk. We need to talk. Um... <clears throat> I really don't know how <laughs> this is going to end up. <laughs> how I'm gonna do this, but I'm gonna just I'm gonna just follow spirit. Hey boo, who is that? Hey Fox, love you too, boo. Um, I want to talk about a, a a a few things that I've been seeing. Um, and I feel like people don't get it. We need to talk about this as a tribe, as a family. Um, which subject I want to start on? I, I want to go back to when I had a channel message. I think I did it about, I want to say two weeks ago. Um, and I was talking about our children and how we needed to protect them. Hey, E. Um, today I'm on my Yemiya and my At Abatala and my Oshun. I feel more Abatala right now. Who is Abatala? It's a Yoruba deity that rules your head. Okay. This, uh, even though his day is on Sunday. Oh, this issue coming through. This is issue day. This is Monday. This is Monday. This is Mercury day. Okay. Yeah. I did a channel a few weeks ago and I talked about our children. I talked about how we need to protect them and how things are, are coming out of the wash, how it's just a lot going on right now. Okay. Hey, Latonya. Hey, baby. So when I did the channel, I spirit pushed me to do it. Okay. I'm not really big on doing channels like like that live because I like to be in a med meditation place. Like I like to be in my own little sacred space and I put it out. Hey, Louis. So now that I'm looking at this, I said, okay, Spirit did that for a reason. Um, and <sighs> the children. That's south of the border of Texas. That disturbs me. It disturbs me. And if you do not feel disturbed about that, I don't care if they're not. I've seen people to say, well, it ain't my children. It has nothing to do with me. And I'm like, what? kids like these are babies people talking about it's illegal people talking about you know they already know what it is you know when you come over here nah nah these babies are in cages away from their parents that's some bs then oh my god The Lissandro, this baby in the Bronx, I found that out on my vacation about this baby. And I'm like, what? These people, five dudes just took the baby out the store and killed him outside the bodega? My question is, why didn't the dudes that worked in the bodega, because I think they said it was three people that worked in there, why did you just then keep him 
and locked him out and called the police. And then I'm thinking, it's certain things, y'all, I don't like to talk about, but these are the things we have to talk about because people are saying it has nothing to do with me. It has everything to do with you because what if they was to come to your, you know, get your children or my thing with the Lasandro case, and I wanted to really do a separate video because I wanted, he actually, I felt his spirit when I seen the video. I don't know if you all seen it, but the candles knocked over. And I said, that baby doesn't even... Y'all have to understand, a spirit doesn't know sometimes that they're dead. Okay? What he went through was a traumatic experience. So your energy could be earthbound, not realizing what happened. Okay? And my thing is with him... I don't care if it was mistaken, I did it or not. What possessed you to what possessed you to say, oh, I'm gonna just get this person? Like, y'all didn't even get the right person. I'm angry, I'm bowling. Like, what is going on? The things that are happening now, y'all, the things that's going on right now is showing us that. There's a lot of people that's walking dead around here. There's zombies around here. They have no feelings. Okay? What is showing me, one of the laws in the universe is compassion. And we do not have that. There's a lot of people that do not have compassion. And I even heard that the boy, I really should have read up on it. I was really looking at pieces. I'm the type of person to get my receipts together before I do something like this, but I had to speak on it because it's sad that I go into medica meditation and I start crying. This could have been my nephew. This could have been my brother. This could have been my child. So you're telling me, and I, I've rolled through the Bronx by myself, okay? I rolled through the Bronx. And you're telling me, how close the buildings are, everything. Y'all didn't see nobody walking around there. You didn't see that baby running. You didn't see him blood gushing out. If it was my child, I would have said, get your ass in this car so we can go. So we can go to the hospital. Ain't nobody seen that baby. Nobody. The people in the bodega, you didn't call the police and say, hey, is something going on out here? You just let them be. Y'all, where's the compassion at? Where's the compassion? This is America. It's ridiculous. I, I'm truly like, <laughs> it's crazy. The shootings are still happening with our boys. Ain't nobody seen nothing. It was a little girl. I think I want to say it was in the Bronx too. I think she got decap uh, decapitated, if I said it right. Do you, y'all don't understand the power that you have? We can keep this from happening, you know? Somebody said people was taught to, to mind their business. It's sad. Cause if it was my child, I would want somebody else to do something. I'd be like, look, take them, take care of them. What happened to the village? We don't have the village anymore. We're crabs in a bucket. Everybody fending for themselves. It don't have to be like that. That's westernized thinking. It's not my child, so I'm not gonna worry about it. It ain't my people, so I don't have to worry about it. But I feel like if the tables was to turn and it was to truly to happen to you, you would want that same energy. Somebody said people don't even know that they next door next. Man, it's people. People stay to themselves because things are crazy. People, you. <sighs> Y'all, I had love. I had love. 
this man next door, he took care of my grandmother and my grandfather for a year. I want to say 35 years. And I had left and went out of town. And I usually leave my keys with him. Danny. I usually leave my keys with him. At some point, y'all, mind you, and you know, sometimes you get caught up when you ready to go, you ready to go, or whatever, what have you. When I touch down, I forgot to, I said, okay, as soon as I touch down, I'm going to call him and say I made it or whatever. Danny came looking for me, him and his wife. He was like, where is you? Because I, I haven't seen you in, in days. That's a true ass neighbor, y'all. For him to say, oh, I haven't seen. We have to change. And I was telling a friend the other day, we were sitting and talking about this. It's going to be a point. And I don't want to speak this into existence. I don't really want to say it. But there's going to be a situation. It's going to be a drastic situation. Where... We're going to have to come back together. You can't question what religion are you? Oh, you Christian, I can't help you. Or you gay, I can't help you because I don't know. It's going to be none of that. It's going to be a situation where we're going to have to come back together so you all can learn compassion again. Because this is ridiculous. And I love how Bronx came together. I love how Bronx had came, put their candles, we come together, we praying. As a matter of fact, if y'all even know the mother, I'm willing to do healing sessions with her. Because I know this is gonna this is gonna be hard for her. I'm willing to do massages, I'm willing to do Reiki. If y'all can get a hold of her, by all means, y'all can give her my information, my video, whatever, what have you. I will definitely do it. This is ridiculous. And honey, Bobby, you're cute. You're right. But like I said, it's going to take something real, something real crazy for us to get together. <clears throat> I have to get that off my chest. I will when my when I'm right, when my spirit is right. Um oh okay, spirit told me to do it now. I'm going to obey. <sighs> I am going to obey spirit. So what I'm going to do, um, and y'all forgive me in advance, because <laughs> as a medium, you have to kind of put your emotions to the side in order to read or channel. Um, I asked Spirit earlier if I was able to connect with um, Lysandra. I hope I'm saying his name right. Um... And they're telling me it's not inappropriate. I really don't. <laughs> Y'all be with me. That's all I'm going to say. Because I feel like when he knocked the candles over, when his spirit knocked the candles over, he was, I felt a sense of sadness. I felt the sit. Uh, um, I felt he was scared, but he was angry. So what I'm going to do. I want to do this for his mother's sake, his family's sake. Ugh. Before I get started, I want to send him Reiki energy. Y'all, when I was in meditation, I asked my grandma. I always ask spirit before I do a reading on any energy. She was like, yes. Like.
what I'm doing right now is I'm channeling. <sighs> Y'all forgive me in advance if I start crying. Let me get my tissue. The feeling that I'm getting right now is like everything is here in the throat chakra. Um, needing to communicate. Um, I'm, Usually when... <sighs> spirits go through something traumatic, there's an astral plane that's for healing, period. Okay? Also, y'all, the glass just dropped in the kitchen. Okay. Spirit of love and light, I ask that the ancestors be with me at this time. I ask my grandmother for guidance. I ask that she be a messenger. Thank you, Spirit. Spirit at this time, I ask to connect with Osandro. I ask that my spirit guide surround him, protect him. At this time, we send loving energy to him. Osandro, I ask that you speak to your family. Through this message, <clears throat> through these cards, <clears throat> okay, so we're going to start off. I'm here at the number 10. We have beginning. <clears throat> Evolution. Mmm, that's positive. It's the beginning for him. He's in he's evolving. Right now, I feel a sense of calmness. I'm hearing he's spiritually protected. Thank you. Inappropriate time. Was an inappropriate time. He felt powerless. He was disappointed. He, I just keep hearing him say, I needed help. I needed help. I'm hearing father. Or he has, he said father. I'm hearing him, when he said father, he said someone I looked up to as a father. That's what I'm picking up. Okay. Okay. Laughter. Lovers. He 
For some reason, when I seen lovers, I heard Gemini, if that makes sense to whoever that who watches this. As you know, the lovers in the tarot deck is considered the Gemini card. Okay. Health. And then he says abundance. <sighs> I do feel like he's accepted it. It is hard for him. Man, this is hard. I'm being asked to do another row. I'm going to kind of shuffle the cards so up. And I feel like who, whoever his people are, when they see it, it'll make sense. That's what he keeps telling me. It'll make sense. He's showing me head. And I heard the word knowledge. Like maybe someone had knowledge of something. He's showing me his arms. He's showing, okay, he, he showed me his arms, and then he said something about a tattoo, and I'm hearing right, so that could be something. <clears throat> Spirit, thank you, I said to sneak in front of my face. I'm pulling. He's also giving me the number five. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to just go ahead and pull it out. Pull the cards out. I'm going to pull 10. He is such a sweet boy, y'all. He showed me this inappropriate form. Love. If some of you don't know the story, um, there was a video out with this girl. I, something happened in a video. It got out. That was the reason why they was going after the dude because whoever recorded it put it out so they was going to search for the boy the boy was mistaken identity okay they end up getting Lissandra to the boy and so um and that's how everything transpired um so we like, I'm gonna show y'all the cards again he said inappropriate form love and I'm gonna tell you this I feel like and I was speaking with another sister on Facebook because the whatever happened to him, they gonna get they 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 gonna get their time. The people, everybody involved. And I feel like what pisses him off is that don't show him no fake love going to his memorial and putting the candles down when y'all seen that baby run down the street trying to get to the hospital. Rage. Of course he's gonna be pissed. 
Y'all seen me, but now you want to show me love after the death? Fuck you. That was from him. We have creator. We have female. Feeling. Mother. Healing. I'm going to pull a couple more cards because he's telling me to. <clears throat> Change. Generational pattern. Even if this baby has passed over, he's teaching. Y'all, we have to learn when situations like this happen. And even if it doesn't affect us in our family physically, spiritually, it does something to all of us. This baby just said we need to change the generational pattern. Revenge does not have to be physical like people get riled up get angry get ready to force people telling lies people doing stuff he said generational pattern this has Lissandra do you want me do you want me to move to any other cards he said no he said what he had to say. Is there anything else you would like for me to say? I just keep hearing him say, Mom. That got to be the hardest thing for a child to lose, a mother to lose her child. I couldn't imagine losing my mama. I couldn't imagine how my mama would feel if she was to lose me. Yeah, we have to change. We have to find compassion. Because this is not life. One day you think you're good. Life is going. And then all of a sudden, something unexpected happens. This. We have to change. The war is spiritual and it's physical, but it's more spiritual than anything. And if this story didn't move you, you do not have a heart because this is crazy. I'm not even going to tell the baby to rest in peace to rise in power. y'all I just have to get that off my chest and I hope his mama see this I hope it makes sense to them okay I just keep clarifying to them if I need to do anything else but other than that I hope this changed our perspective <clears throat> All right, you all. Much love and light to you all. I'll see you all in the next feed.